questions, there's no doubt what the target is. And that's worldwide shale. And I think they're afraid that Europe is going to start uh, developing shale. Uh, I know that some of the New Mexico, Texas companies were over trying to do fracking in Spain recently, and that's what they're frightened of, that the, those countries will do it. They've seen it happen in Pennsylvania and some of the states that used to not have a, uh, production. So I just I believe they're absolutely trying to shut the industry down. And if we allow them, shame on us. Uh, what should be done then? No, I just think that we uh, need to be able to export the oil would be the beginning thing. Uh, if myself, uh, if they continued in that stance, I would not mind for the U.S. government to start charging them a fee uh, for securing the oceans. Right now we provide all the security in the world for all the oceans and they get to ship free of charge. And so the American taxpayers pay for that. The tankers uh, travel the oceans and, and pretty much uh, without a fear of piracy. And uh, so that stability comes from U.S. fleets. And uh, so that's a very expensive thing. And if Saudi Arabia is just kind of working along with us and everything's going fine. They've got a market share, we've got a market share, and our products can compete with theirs on the open market fine. But when they start uh, trying to drive the price and manipulate an outcome, that's when I would get uh, more involved. I just don't think we should stand by while people are struggling right now and act like it's not occurring and like the government can do nothing. I think we have a lot of moves. So what those moves could be somebody uh, you know, smarter than myself. I would not sit here and just accept it.